My name is Richard Schugart, and uh, I'm at Western Kentucky University. I'm, a, I'm our director for, for the Applied Center for Data Science, and so I've come here to, to get more connected with, with, with the community. This is my first time here. What do you think so far with being your first time here? Uh, it, it, it's it's been great. The, the talks have been great. It's been nice meeting you know a you know a variety of people and just just you know just interacting with with people in people in the industry, other people from from academia as well. And, and uh, you know it's been I've had a great time here so far. Well, that sounds great. So, have you learned anything really exciting or new that you can't wait to take back and maybe explore a little further? Anything new or exciting? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe AI, yeah, any yeah. Of stuff. Like yeah, the the uh, some of the stuff on generative AI, I think I think can be you know is is really interesting that that, that I think could be uh, you know that uh, you know it's just amazing to see how quickly th things have moved. With, you know, yeah. Uh, so. I went to, uh, you know, people are always like, how many years of AI experience do you have? And I'm like, well, I mean, I don't know that anybody has like <laughs> a ton of generative AI experience for right. sure. Right. Yeah, like right. they didn't teach that right. at... Right, right, right. right. I know, uh, you know, exactly. So They did not teach that at WKU when I was there years no. ago. We won't say how many years, but a few years ago. <laughs> so I know a lot's changed. Um, what are some exciting things that are going on at WKU that you want to share with us? Well, every year we have we have a, a data science day on campus, and so that'll, that'll be in April this year. And so you know we you know you know anyone is welcome to welcome to come. We'll have more details on that. You know we're, we're working on that kind of stuff. We're also working on trying to develop a you know we, we don't have a data science major, which I think is a little bit of a problem. But on you know on the other hand, I, I expect that we will that we will have you know have one very soon. We're working on it. We have a lot of administrative support, which is also important as as well. Um, we also have have. A we also have a center for 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 business data analytics. You know, the, you know they have an, they have an undergraduate major, and and so you know so there, there's you know we're continuing we're slowly but continuing to 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 expand, you know uh, you know what, what we do on our campus and, and and are expanding our reach as well. So awesome. Now, how many students are there? When I was there, I think it was about ten thousand students. Uh, tuition was a little lower than two. <laughs> I think the numbers on the order are about seventeen thousand. So okay. wow, that's a that's a big. Uh, Big, yeah, big span well, there. <laughs> a lot bigger than when, when you were there, but yeah, so. And for those of you listening, if you have not been to the WKU campus, it is really beautiful. It's in the town of Bowling Green, Kentucky, home of the Corvette. Yep. So also a fun thing to look at. Yeah, we're, we're about an hour north of, of Nashville, Tennessee. And so, you know, kind of, we're kind of, you know, situated between Nashville and Louisville. And, and so, you know, and, and so, we, you know, we get a lot, a lot of students from, 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 from both areas as well as, you know, from, from the South Central Kentucky area where, where, where we're located too. So. Awesome. Well, that sounds fantastic. Well, um, big question that we've been asking everybody is if you had to predict the future with all of the analytics and AI and everything, what's the next big topic? Like this year's clearly generative AI, thanks to ChatGPT, yeah. but what's next year, maybe the year after? What's next year? Uh, <laughs> I, don't, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> you know I, I, I don't know. I, I haven't. No, I, I mean, we, we don't know either. We've been asking everybody. I mean, if you had a crystal ball, that would be amazing. I would love to know. Try to take a great guess. <laughs> Okay, well, I um, appreciate your time. Any final remarks before we let you get back to the conference? Uh, you know, so, so if, you're, if you're looking for colleges, you know, con consider Western Kentucky University. You know, we, you know, as I said, we're, we're, we're expanding our, you know, our data, d you know, data science, data analytics reach. And, and so, you know, you know if, you, if you're, you know, you or you, know, you, you have children that, that are looking, you know, consider us. Yeah, um, I can second that. Um, I went to WKU, and I can say without a doubt that uh, without Dr. Jeff Butterfield, I would not be in technology today. He pulled me aside one day and said, you're really good at this, and I think you could make a career out of it. And um, that was amazing. And to have people that care is a tremendous thing. Yeah, that, that, I mean, that's one of the nice things about Western Kentucky University is, you know, the, you know, some, you know, the, the, you know, the number of students that have come back and, and just said, you know, th this professor, you know, had, had, you know, such a huge influence on us and that, and, you know, and so that's, you know, that you, you, know, you get a lot you can get a lot of individual attention at, at the yeah. game so yeah uh, having people that care is amazing so thank you so much and um, enjoy the rest of your day thanks a lot appreciate it